How to install and use Namecheap VPN. The first thing you'll need to do is click on my referral link and once you've done that you'll be taken to this web page here. Once you're here scroll down and you'll be able to see Namecheap's VPN plans. When you click on my referral link you'll get a couple of discounts. First of all for the monthly plan you'll get 100% off on the first month and for the yearly plan you'll get 83% off and for the three year plan, you'll get 68% off. So those are the benefits for using my referral link. In today's video, we're going to be utilizing the monthly plan as we get 100% off on the first month. So the first 30 days are for free. And if you do go with the one year plan or three year plan, you have 30 day money back guarantee. I'm just going to scroll down just to show you some bonus features here of Namecheap VPN. So as you can see, you get no logs, you get unlimited bandwidth on all devices. And lastly, there's a feature that's called Always Protected, and that gives you auto connect and kill switch, and this will keep you protected at all times. I'm just going to scroll down a little more just to show you what countries are available. So as you can see, they have about a thousand servers with 50 plus locations. Let's scroll down a little more just to see more features. And as you can see, it's also available on Android, Windows, iOS, Mac OS, your router, and Linux. So it's available on pretty much all operating systems. Let's continue scrolling down and let's select our plan. So as I said already, we're going to be going with the monthly plan, giving us 100% off the first month. So click on start my plan, left click on this. You'll then be taken to the billing page. As you can see, we have the unlimited VPN with one month subscription and it's going to cost us a total of zero. Continue scrolling down. Here you'll need to connect your billing information. As you can see, for me, I already have $13 in my account, so we're going to be utilizing that. However, we will not be charged if we cancel just before our trial ends. So click on Confirm Payment once you've linked your billing details. And just like that, you're done. So as you can see, you're greeted with the following message that says thank you for your subscription, and then it gives you a list of operating systems that you can download Namecheap VPN onto. I forgot to mention, if you don't have a Namecheap account, you will need to create one before you'll be able to buy Namecheap VPN. Okay guys, today I'm on Windows, so that's what we're going to be downloading today for today's tutorial. So I'm just going to left click on Windows here, and the download should hopefully start. Yeah, there we go on the bottom right hand corner there. I'll be back once the download finishes. And there we go guys, our download has been completed. Now navigate to the bottom left hand corner there, and left click on the Namecheap VPN installer arrow here, and then click open. Once you've done that, the installer will start opening. You'll be greeted with the terms and conditions. Just click I accept and then click install. Namecheap VPN will then begin installing. All right, guys, as you can see, I'm greeted with the completion window here, which says complete the Namecheap VPN setup wizard. Click the finish button to exit the setup wizard. So I'm just going to left click on finish. And then the Namecheap VPN client that you've just installed should boot up. Now you'll need to sign in if you have a Namecheap account. If you don't and you're a new user, you'll need to click on sign up here and then you'll be taken through the sign up process. All right, guys, as you know, I already have an account, so I'm just going to left click on sign in here. And now I'm just going to fill in my Namecheap username and password. Once you've done that, guys, click on sign in. Once you've signed in, you'll be greeted with this notice here, which says before you connect, your privacy is our top priority. And then it talks about that the email address that you provide is just so that you can log in and use the service. And that aggregated anonymous app usage data will be used by Namecheap for troubleshooting and to improve their app. And a reminder that there are no logs, no tracking of your personal identifiable information. That's great, guys. So I'm just going to hit I understand. Once you've done that, you'll be greeted with the Namecheap VPN user interface. By default, you'll be given the best available VPN for you and a big green button here that you can straight away connect to to begin browsing the internet privately. For the sake of this video, I'm not going to connect with the best available VPN for me. I'm going to choose my own VPN connection. So to do that, just click the arrow on the top left hand corner there left click on it and then you'll be given a list of the available locations that you can connect to. Straight away actually I'm very impressed with the array of locations that Namecheap VPN has. I'm just going to scroll down just to show you. 
yeah, there's a lot of countries here that you can connect to, which is very, very good in my humble opinion. For today's video, I'm going to be connecting to a Spanish VPN as the ping time is quite good on Spain. So I'm just going to left click on it here. And then I have two options here, Madrid or Valencia. I'm going to go with Valencia as the ping time is much lower. So I'm just going to left click on this and then Namecheap VPN will begin connecting us to Spain in Valencia. And there we go, just like that, we're connected. Namecheap VPN then provides us with the IP address that we're using. So for this video, we're using 185.153.150.26, and the connection time has been around 30 seconds. The protocol is IKEV2. So let's quickly check if our IP address is masked by a Spanish Valencia IP address. Very quickly here, so I'm just going to minimize the Namecheap VPN client, and then I'm going to to hit the home button here real quick just to go to duckduckgo.com real quick and then I'm going to type in what is my IP address and then I'm going to hit enter. So according to DuckDuckGo our IP address is 185.153.150.26 and we're in Valencia, Spain. Very smooth. Namecheap VPN has indeed masked our IP address. That pretty much concludes the video guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video.